810, the Marvel Universe comes alive this weekend at Target Center in Minneapolis. See all of your favorite superhero characters like Captain America, Thor, Spider-Man. 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 <laughs> Spider <-Man. laughs> might have been a Seinfeld character. That would be Spider-Man, mm -hmm. Iron Man, and more. Fans will, put, uh, will be put right in the middle of all the electrifying battles between good and evil. And the success of all the Marvel films over the past few years no doubt leads to the crazy popularity of this type of show. People are loving this. But the story that you're going to see in this show is something that you won't find on the big screen, making it a one-of-a-kind experience that we had to check out. Yeah, this is like a movie, uh, pretty much. You know, you have all the action sequences that you'll see in a movie. Pyrotechnics, explosions, you have car chases, motorcycles in, uh, in the show, uh, people doing crazy acrobats, it's, it's insane. Were you comic book fans and superhero fans growing up? Of course, of course. I actually remember running home from the school bus uh, when I went to Hopkins. Uh, um, used to come home and watch Spider-Man and X-Men. I was ready to see him every single day, yeah. And now you are. Yes, exactly. Yes. Now I'm Iron Man. Uh, it's a lot of training. Uh, we all come from different backgrounds. Some people are gymnasts. Some people are aerialists. Uh, some people are trickers. They, you know, flip and, and do front flips, back flips, stuff like that. Uh, we had an athletic uh, background, so we grew up doing sports, uh, which kind of led us into dance and theater. Does something happen when you put on that costume? <laughs> yes. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah, like, exactly. What, what happens in that moment? Well, as Loki, uh, uh, when you play a bad guy, when you see yourself, it's... Uh, it definitely helps you get into the character. And then seeing people, uh, seeing people in the audience look at you and uh, um, definitely pumps you up and, and helps the, the character development. We travel uh, with, this, with this set. Um, this is a Statue of Liberty, and there's a fight scene that happens on the Statue of Lib Liberty. Uh, and it, it starts kind of uh, lower, and then it moves uh, around in a spiral. So, um, so cool. yeah, people are falling from the top of it, coming down, fighting each other, being lifted back up. It's, it's pretty cool. I would count myself in this group. So the nerdy comic book yeah. kids that oh, are yeah. still in grade school or middle school and getting picked on, what do Loki and Captain America have to say to them? Um, don't let anyone, you know, uh, discourage you in anything you want to do in life. I, I started late. I was 22, and I never thought I would end up being an acrobat. I see flips. I'm like, that's impossible. Went to a gym one day, started doing it. It's just all about determination and passion. Work every day, and you'll achieve anything that you want to. And I'm, now I'm Iron Man, so you can be whoever you want in life. What a show. And those two are brothers, by the way. So yeah. Loki and Iron Man, who hate each other, right. they, they are actually, brothers in real life. They are, yeah. <laughs> they, they trade off which role they play because yeah. it's so athletic for those performers. Um, it, you know, they need a little bit of a rest. You know, so they're doing three shows a day, right. which is crazy. They're also working out. They're training. Uh, Marvel shows, you know, the Marvel Universe live shows today at Target Center, 11, 3, and 7 o'clock tonight. The tickets range from 20 to $95. There's shows tomorrow, too. But mm -hmm. I just was floored at the amount of athleticism. We saw just one scene in person, and I, I just can't imagine that just how in shape they have to be to yeah, be able to, to do this for a couple of hours yeah I, when they uh, some of the performers get in town you know they check out the local gyms and so maybe you've seen them around downtown working out or maybe uh, you'll just see them in costume I tell you what though I, that type of training yeah. is exactly what I need I know they're being forced <laughs> to do it I could choose to do it but I don't I no, just choose we to don't. talk to them back to the peanut butter yeah right exactly yes.